Hey, it's Joshua Gar from Android Authority. What's going on, everybody? And here I am with our first hands-on with the Moto 360. Now, one thing I will tell you right now, as you can probably see on the screen already, is that pretty much every device that you're going to be seeing on the floor today is in demo mode, so that's exactly what we're looking at here. But I will be able to scroll through a few of the elements, as you can see right here. Um, so, uh, the other thing too is, even though it is in a demo mode, we will be seeing this same operating system, the Android Wear UI, on the LG G Watch, which I will be picking up tomorrow, so I'll give you a more in-depth look on that tomorrow. But for now, we just wanted to take a look at the actual device itself. It has the nice round look to it, and actually, I'm going to go ahead and just put on the device right now. And we have premium, premium materials all around, including this leather that I have just looking really lovely and I will tell you this I have been told by one of the uh, Moto representatives that this watch one of their favorite features of it is the fact that it is actually really light um, compared to even analog watches that you'll see today by and I heard the name Michael Kors thrown around a little bit <laughs> but nonetheless we have a pretty tall device actually it's actually a little bit tall right here but what I've been told is that it's not going to make much of a difference when you're having your clothes on and whatnot it really isn't an impedance and also the other reason why the round uh, design was uh, really gone for in the Moto line was because this little bone right here that you have here won't be won't, won't be impeded with your wrist movement so that's really a nice uh, that's a nice feature in terms of comfort but all around we have a very nice feel this is the uh, leather right here and it feels really nice on the skin here please excuse my wristband for tonight's party <laughs> uh, but let's go ahead and go through the op uh, the operating system just a little bit here's your watch face and uh, you have the, the really nice looking watch face that goes around obviously when it comes to the round face you have the wonderful looking clock right here and here's an example of a notification and it's Alice Yang and if I were to scroll up from there you not only see the contact picture in the background but you also see the actual text itself and if I move over to the right we'll be able to reply very quickly and be able to reply via voice obviously I'm not saying that right now it is in demo mode like I said but I'll go ahead and get back to it so here we are back here and since I dismissed the text notification I now have a weather area that shows London and I will be able to see some extra information on that, the five day forecast. Here is a pedometer uh, that is available on there and it's, there you go. And if we keep going, we'll be able to see various other cards that are available using this UI. 36 minutes to get home. Here is the flight information for a flight that might come up a little bit later. And you will be able to have information from that particular email or rather from Google Now sent to the watch. So you'll be able to use that. And of course, a music player that is available right here. Going to next, previous, being able to change the music track, calendar entries, and that pretty much does it for at least the ones we're able to look at in this demo. Uh, coming up to the end right here, what I just wanted to show you one last time was right here saying, OK, Google. OK, Google. And there you go, I actually said it in the sentence, so there it is. And you go straight into Google Voice, and you'll be able, not Google Voice, Google Now, in the sense that you'll be able to use voice activated searches and any uh, functionality after that. So that's just a quick look at the Moto 360. Uh, it will be out later this summer, and they are being pretty tight lipped about the actual date, keeping it pretty vague, but this summer could mean anywhere from next week to next month. So we're really looking forward to getting our hands on the Moto 360. We'll give you an in depth review on it once it comes out. But this was just your first look at one of the first smartwatches to have Android Wear. This is Joshua Vigar from Android authority coming to you live from Google I.O. 2014.